Hey guys, it's Tony with Backwoods Biker Magazine again. It's May, and it's time to look at Battle Box Mission Number Fifty One. Hang tight. All right, guys, uh, welcome back. The May box from Battle Box uh, has got some pretty neat stuff in it. Um, and let me just get started with you right away. Going to bring you up to speed here again. Uh, Battle Box has changed the way they do this. No longer do they do a theme, uh, but they kind of spread out their gear uh, to where everyone is going to be able to uh, get a little uh, extra out of these boxes. Um, once again, just to cover the bases here, the basic level costs $29.99. The advanced level costs $59.99. The pro level costs $99.99. And the pro plus, which is also the knife, knife of the month club, is $149.99. And each of those values um, at least double and sometimes they are, are triple, you know, what we have found. Um, so let's just get right into this here for mission number 51. And the first item that we have is from K-Bar, um, and this is a tactical spork. Um, I'm not a guy that usually takes out, you know, utensils uh, like this uh, at all. I usually fashion my own if I need them, or it's already in some type of kit that I'm using, some bush stove kit uh, like I, I use from uh, Silverfire, the Silverfire Scout. But this is kind of a cool little spork here. Uh, very lightweight, very, very small, but not only is it a spork, but whenever you press this and you pull it apart, you get a knife. It's a serrated knife. Uh, it feels like a metal blade. It may not be, but I mean, it's it's very stout. No, it's not a metal blade. It's actually a, a part of the handle, and this is kind of like a polycarbonate. It's very, very hard and very sturdy, but now you've got a knife to go along with your spork. And uh, that can always be handy. So that's a neat little gizmo right there that goes uh, with this particular box. And it has a value of $7.99. Um, next thing is called the Breakthrough Clean Military Grade Solvent. For those of you that are long gun users or uh, assault rifle style users, you know how quick carbon can build up. And carbon is not your friend. Breakthrough has developed this... Um, military grade solvent that is kind of like a green solvent um, it doesn't have a lot of smell to it um, matter of fact you know I, we sprayed it over and over again and there was really no smell but it breaks down carbon very very quick helps you to clean your firearm doesn't matter what it is but also just as a bonus tip anything that you might have uh, some type of buildup on it, metal, even a knife. This can help you clean it and it keeps the environment safe uh, as you go. It's clean technology. They give this a value of $8.95 and that's exactly what we found it for on the internet. Next thing up is uh, kind of a novelty item. I've never seen these before. Uh, I've never even heard of them before, but these are from a company. Um, let me see here. Going, no, 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 no. Let's see. Uh, doesn't give the name of the company, uh, but it is Eat Your Coffee. Uh, maybe that is the name of the company. Um, but what these are is caffeinated snack bars. And both of these are fudgy mocha latte. And I believe there's three different flavors that are available. Um, again, I've never tried these. These are non-GMO. Um, and these are pretty much uh, veggie if you want them. But to give you an idea, uh, every bar is about 180 calories, at least these bars are. Um, and let me see, the carbs in these is 25 grams, 9%. does have some sugars, 12 grams of uh, sugars in it. Uh, but, you know, I'm kind of stoked about trying one of these out. But uh, from what I've been told, uh, they do put a little pep in your step, and that's not what I'm wanting today. I'll wait till I get out. Uh, humping with a pack or something to uh, try one of these, but I'm kind of excited about that. They give these a value of $4.99. Um, and again, that's what we found them for, you know, so, so far we are, are right on the money with this. And then the last thing 
uh, in this basic level is from Lord and Field. It's called the Dungaree Denim Micarta Folding Knife. Uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, you, you find a lot of things from Lord and Field in the battle box uh, for the past six months or so. Lord and Field is something like a uh, sister company of, of battle box, but they're not really uh, owned by battle box. But Every piece of gear that we have seen from them has been quality. We've enjoyed it, and we thought it was a great bargain. Uh, this particular knife, they give a value of $39.99. Uh, you really can't shop them unless you just shop general type of knife it is. And, you know, for us, this was priced lower than what we thought it should be. Uh, but it comes in this neat little cardboard sleeve. And as always, when you get a knife from them, it comes in this oiled up paper. And this is a knife that has denim micarta on it. Uh, for those of you that may not know how micarta is made, usually uh, the protocol is taking layers of canvas and stacking it and putting between each layer uh, some type of epoxy resin and let it get hard. You know, I can't tell you how many layers are in this. Looks like there's about 10 layers that might be in this. And once it gets hard, you can shape it to the scales of the knife that you put it on. It's very, very rugged. This is a, a, a neat little knife. And, uh, you know, a couple of the guys that have looked at this said it reminds them of something that, you know, uh, Buck may have put out years ago or an old timer or something like that. But it is very, very sturdy. Um, and it doesn't tell us what type of steel it is, but it looks to me to be some type of stainless. It does have a nice 90 degree spine on it. And the locking system is simple to, to put it back in the, in the side, the, the sheath, or excuse me, the scales. It's a nice little knife. Very, very comfortable. Very, very light. It's a great buy for $39.99. Now, again, this level only costs you $29.99, and it has a value of $61.92. We thought that was a little light uh, because of the knife. We were thinking around $45 to $47 for this knife. All right. <clears throat> Let's put that to the side and go to the advanced box. A couple really neat pieces of gear in here. The first one is called the Ready Man Fort Foreign Object Removal Tools. Um, when I looked at this first, you know, the first thing that, you know, I see is, is that the, the pouch that it comes in, it's just a vinyl pouch. Uh, and I, I tore that already, you know. I mean, the pouch is not the secret to the sauce here. It's what comes inside of here. So I'm going to take it all out and then I will talk to you about it as I do. Let's get it out of this cheesy pouch. I'm sure that you've got a room in another pouch. Uh, but there are five different items, tools, and then six if you include the alcohol pads. Uh, but the tools that they have in here, first of all, you know, the alcohol pads, there's four of them in here. And then it has an eye loop. And what this, this kit is designed for is to help you remove foreign objects, maybe out of your, your finger or maybe somebody else's eye that you're trying to help them out with. comes with this light. That's pretty cool. Uh, we like this a lot. You know, it, it does a great job. It's got two different settings on the light, high and low beam. And it's got two different eye loops that uh, you can really see things up close if you need to. Now, I do like that being in there. It's a little bulky, but uh, I do like that with the light. comes with uh, stainless steel tweezers. And these tweezers uh, are not the flimsy style that you often find in a secondary kit like this. These are like a medical grade um, tweezer. Very, very stout. They're not going to bend and they're not going to lose objects that you try to grab a hold of. <clears throat> Next up is these folding scissors, which again, it, you know, they impressed this. They got our attention because these are truly usable. They're very, very sharp. I mean, right out of the box here, they are cutting hair without a problem. They'll cut bandages. They'll cut whatever. But what is really neat is how they go back together. They're very, very safe. And they just fit like that right there, uh, right out of, the, out of the bag like that. So those are very heavy duty also. And then these two tools, I really like these things. Um, they come inside of this stainless steel threaded tube. 
Uh, and I'll be honest with you, what I did when I first started messing with these, they were a little bit uh, sticky. I couldn't get them to really come in and out very well. So what I did was I took, let me see here, I had it here earlier. Uh, I took bush butter and what I did, I just put it right here on the tool, on the inside of the tool itself. And then when I screw this down in here, it is as smooth as, as you can get. And I do the same thing on the other end. And this particular tool, uh, each, each one of them has a tool on each end. And when you deploy these, this one has, it almost looks like an awl, but it's, it, you know, I mean, there's different things that you can do. Again, this is called a foreign object removal tool. Now, the one down here that we were trying to get, you know, what this was here, I don't know if it's to help you pull up splinters or what, but it's like a heavy duty piece of fishing line that bends. You know, you can write me and tell me what this is if you'd like. Uh, but that's your first tool right there. And then the second one, it's a little more serious. Um, again, it's, it's pointed. And we'll go ahead and put this in here like so. Yeah, the bush butter, I mean, you can put whatever you want in it if you'd like. Looks like I didn't put it in that one, but I am gonna put it in there now. You can put whatever you want. If you've got fixing wax or whatever, that's what bush butter is. It's the next generation fixing wax. And it comes from woodtrampgear.com. Uh, but this one here is, is a, a very sharp probing tool. I mean, I can just, I can go through my skin with that with ease. And this is, is a tool that you can push out different splinters foreign objects that you might have from under your skin or whatever so there you have that and that is from uh, ready man and uh, you know what we're going to do is and i'll be honest with you i'm going to lose this plastic or vinyl pouch whatever it is because it it's really cheesy uh, but the tools inside of it itself makes it well worth your time and your effort uh, to be able to put these in your kit or just fashion yourself a kit out of canvas and that's probably what i will do or i might add it to my uh, carving set i don't know but we'll do something with that uh, they give this a value of 39 dollars and 99 cents and again it's exactly what you're going to find on the internet <clears throat> now the next one i really like this uh, particular item this is from going gear and it is a micro driver and bit set um, not so much something that you would carry out in the bush with you. You can, but it's a little bulky for that. But it comes with one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's 24 different size of micro bits. And it comes with a really heavy duty driver. Uh, and what I like about the driver, you know, what we found is, you know, when, when you're trying to, uh, screw or unscrew or, or drill at all, <clears throat> with these micro things they often roll out of your hand with this one all you got to do is hear that yeah that spins all you got to do is hold on to this and you can put constant pressure on whatever it is that you are working with i like these types of tool sets because you can work on your firearms you can work on your electronics you can work on fishing reels on your bows on your crossbows just whatever gear that you might have that might have one of these types of fasteners. And I mean, they're all out there and these cover, uh, different star bits. They have, uh, security bits in them as well. And of course, an assortment of, um, Phillips head bits. They give this a value of $14 and 99 cents. When we went to look at this style with this many, uh, tools in it, the cheapest that we could find it for was $17. So you're saving uh, about two bucks when you go through them. All right. And now you have $116 and 90 cent value and you spent $59.99. They always got a great value with battle box. Okay. The next level is the pro level. And this kind of got us uh, going a little bit here. You know, we've been wondering if we were ever going to see a trail cam, uh, and lo and behold, in this month's battle box, uh, they have from Wild Game Innovations the Terra 10 Extreme 10 megapixel camera, um, and it's 
up to 60 feet, illumination range, less than one second, trigger speed. It's got 21 infrared lenses, LEDs. Um, the video is 720p and up to a year's life uh, for your batteries, which is, to me, you know, that, that really is important, especially when you consider the fact that it takes eight batteries to get this thing going eight double a batteries now that's that's a piece of change but if it'll last a year then you know i'm okay with that uh, the lcd display gives you the time the date you can choose photos images videos whatever you want so this is a great thing to have uh, whether you put it in your backpack and take it with you or you put it out um, where you live at or you have a cabin or you have a homestead whatever trail cams are worth their weight in gold now with this one this one also comes uh, with an SD card but the SD card is given to you for free the price on this trail cam is $49.99 which to us when we did a little shopping for this we did find him for $49.99, but we found these things up to $69 for this particular camera, and you had to buy your own uh, SD card. So that is a, is a great buy, uh, and I'm going to be deploying this uh, out at our um, remote uh, studio. It's our campsite is what it is, so that's good. Now, the next one, I just grabbed this knife. Um, this is the Pro Plus level for which you pay $149.99. By the way, the Pro level is $99. I told you that in the beginning, $99.99, and it has a value of $173.29. That's pretty good. <clears throat> so the Pro Plus level, the knife of the month, has a really, really cool knife from Condor Tool and Knife. This is the Condor Huron. It's a 1095 high carbon steel knife with a leather sheath and you know I've said this a lot about Condor uh, of all the production knives and this is a production knife that we have seen uh, Condor by far has the best sheaths that are out there this is more like you would find in a custom knife makers uh, arsenal when you buy a knife from them these are heavy duty great welts this one here has their logo and also has some nice embossing on it it's it's really really nice I like the sheaths but when you look at the knife, you'll see how to get excited all over again. This is built upon kind of the Hudson Bay uh, Huron style. Uh, they had these knives that were called the Big Eye because the, the uh, pins in them were so big. This is a smaller version of, of that, but it has a brass rope style binding that goes around the wooden scales. Uh, it's, a, it's a beautiful knife. Um, unfortunately, there's not a lot to be said on the card. Um, I'll look here and see. Uh, it's got a convex saber grind, uh, subtle recurve. Uh, let me see. I want to get some of this uh, high quality leather. I got that already. Uh, offers high, 1095 high carbon steel, full tank construction, and an overall length of 8.5 inches. The blade length is 4.25 inches long. You know, I mean, that's that's kind of, you know, a, not a lot of information, but you can get on Condor Tool and Knife to find it out. But I, I got to tell you, this is, is, is you know, I'm not going to say it, it is the perfect knife, uh, but it is kind of like the perfect size of a knife if you're going to be a bushcrafter. Um, if you're just taking this out, you know, for a few days out in the bush, you're not going to chop down any trees with this, but you can process uh, some tinder with it. You can process small pieces of wood with it. And because of how heavy it is, it's put together stout. Condors came a long way. You'll be able to do a little batoning with this. So this level here is $149.99. And it has a value of $258.78. Uh, and again, it, that was a little shy. When we added it up, uh, we were close to $275, maybe $280. So... You're getting a great bargain with this, you know. I mean, BattleBox has impressed us enough that we have continued our relationship with them. And uh, we're going to continue to do so for the rest of this year. And as a matter of fact, 
um, you're getting ready to have the opportunity to read a pretty decent article that we did on them. You know, uh, we have been looking at their boxes all this year. And so we are going to be talking to you in the article. I think the article's ready to launch right now uh, in the May issue, which will be dropping here pretty soon. And you'll be able to see that. Uh, when we shoot a video and stick that out for you, you can go out to the website at backwoodsbiker.com and read the magazine for free. Uh, but we're doing that, and then in the month of June, which is going to be our mid-year special edition, we're going to have another article uh, kind of about Battle Box, but it's not about Battle Box. It's about the guy that you see doing all their videos on YouTube, Curran 1776. Um, the guy is, is probably one of the best pitchmen uh, that I've seen in the business in a long time. He's passionate about what he does. He's knowledgeable about what he shows you. Uh, and he's just a lot of fun. The, the, the guy's ate up just a little bit, you know. Uh, he has enough craziness in him to be able to do this right. And he's also serious. I talked with him for almost an hour on the phone interviewing him. He's got a very, very serious side about what he's doing. So... Uh, let me see here. Well, it also comes with a Condor Tula Knife uh, catalog in here. That's pretty nice. Uh, if you want to see what else they got. Um, tells you a little bit about the knife on how to uh, uh, keep it from rusting on you. Any 1095 or any high carbon steel knife, you got to wipe it down. you got to put some oil on it. Or if you're real smart, you'll get some bush butter from Wood Tramp Gear and you'll put that on your knife. Uh, and then, as they always do, and I think this is kind of cool with Battle Box because not all subscription boxes uh, do this, but they almost always send you these coupon cards uh, that you can use. Um, this says Battle Box Survival and Outdoors Special from Breakthrough Clean Technologies. That's this uh, solvent, remember? If you visit them on their website, you can get 20% off any of your purchase. Uh, and it has the promo code that I never give out here. And let me see, does this have a die date on it? And the answer is no. So it looks like it's good for ever. And then from the same folks um, that we got the coffee treats from, uh, it says, are you energized? Try all three flavors for just $5 plus free shipping. So for five bucks, you can get three more of these. That's a bargain. You know, two of them are $4.99. It's got the code on here. It says it's fair trade, non-GMO, vegan, kosher, gluten-free for all you folks that look for that stuff. If you're not like me, uh, none of that matters to me, really. If it tastes good, I'm eating it. Um, but. It does have an expiration date of January the 1st, 2020, so you got plenty of time. All right, so that's your, your battle box, mission number 51, month of May. Finally, the sun, sun is shining around here, and the rain has laid off of us for a little bit to where we can start getting out. Morels are popping everywhere. Man, I, I bet we've eaten already here probably at least five or six pounds of morels. I love them things. So listen, if you like these videos, we want you to subscribe and that email that's down there. If you want to be added into our monthly giveaways, and we give away some neat gear. We give away knives. We give away sharpening systems. We give away backpacks. You know, we give away a lot of different stuff. So email us there. And all you got to do is put in the email, I'm a subscriber, and then you're put in the database and we randomly pull out one or two, three or four names a month and give away the gear. There is a price for the uh, postage and it usually averages around five bucks, which is nothing if you're getting a 30 or $40 knife or a $50 pack, you know, it's, you know, it's nothing there. So until next time, you ride free, you live free, and you always be safe out there in the bush no matter what you're doing. See ya. Thank you.